Who's better, Dwayne Wade or Carmelo Anthony? Listen, off top, I know you guys will probably say Carmelo Anthony, but it's deeper than that with me when I talk about the game of basketball. Mental is a part of it with me. Now, let's just state the obvious. If I needed somebody to go out there and give me 35 points, who has a better chance of doing it? Carmelo Anthony. Right now, at this point in their career, Carmelo Anthony. But here's the thing. Carmelo Anthony would take at least 35 shots to give me 35 points. Mental. Dwayne Wade would realize that he can't go get 35, and he wouldn't even try to go for it. He just passed the basketball and run the offense. I respect Dwayne Wade so much. I think this argument comes down to what is happening right now. Again, both of these guys passed their prime. Melo's had a couple less injuries than D-Wade. He has a little bit more left in the tank from a night-to-night, can-I-go-hard standpoint. But here's what it comes down to me right now. Dwayne Wade and Carmelo Anthony are on both new teams this year. Both teams that we expect to contend in their respective conferences. Look at what Dwayne Wade's doing and look at what Carmelo Anthony's doing. Melo should be on the bench for the Oklahoma City Thunder. It'd create for a better flow of offense. He'd get more shots. His field goal percentage would probably be a couple points higher. He's playing with the second unit. There'll be more spacing on the court. It'd work out. Dwayne Wade is coming off the bench. As a matter of fact, he told Tyron Lou, I want to come off the bench. Tyron Lou started him. He said, look, no, I want to come off the bench, give JR his spot, and look at how successful the Cavs have been pretty much since that moment happened. They've won 10 straight games. That is the difference. Dwayne Wade has time and time again showed us that he is unselfish, even allowing LeBron James to come down to South Beach and sharing that spotlight when it was Wade County. Chris Bosh as well. Dwayne Wade is just as unselfish as it gets. And that's why his career, when it's all said and done, him and Carmelo Anthony won't be compared in the same stratosphere. So yes, I guess if you want to say Melo's better at more things on the court than Dwayne Wade right now, I'll give you that. But overall, who's a better player? To me, I think part of being better is acknowledging your strengths and weaknesses and Dwayne Wade's better than me. I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. Right now, you're turning up on MrTalaferro.com, shawty.